this very well. Maybe like the 85th time I have filmed this intro clip. Uh, 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 hey. We are Anyway, hi, my name is Sierra, if you have never been here before. Um, yeah, my whole, well not my whole life, but probably since the beginning of high school, I have um, posted videos here and there, never consistently, and before I really got into this video talking about like how I'm trying to stay active and move in my body during quarantine, um, I wanted to talk about why the heck I am never consistent and posting videos and I think once I put it out into the world I will be consistent so that's why I'm saying it I'm not trying to complain I'm not trying to put like excuses really I just want to like say it so that like I can chill out <laughs> um so I feel like <laughs> in social media like things are always perfect and so aesthetic and so beautiful everyone looks perfect everyone like their rooms are perfect their outfits are perfect um everything just like seemingly is perfect and i am just like <laughs> not perfect like i am right now at home my brother graciously is letting me stay in his room um so it's not like perfect in my eyes and um like financially my family isn't like you know so <laughs> um yeah things are not perfect and I just have to like accept that that is okay and that you know it's still worth watching and just because things don't look perfect doesn't mean I have valuable insights in this video I'm talking about slash doing um working out in quarantine and for me this is really interesting because i'm a swimmer and obviously all the pools are closed and um also all of ocean all of like the ocean access by me is closed uh so there is no body of water for me to swim in unless <sighs> yeah i don't even know unless what so um yeah, I'm just figuring out other ways to stay in shape. Luckily, my mom's a personal trainer and our roommate is also a personal trainer. And we are so lucky to have access to the internet now where there are so many different online workouts and fitness people who are posting things. So yeah, let's just get into the video. You'll see what I do. It'll be a good time. Um, Thank you for watching. Okay, I thought I would, um, before I work out, I've been laying in my bed, um, I watched a Haley Fan video, um, but I thought I'd explain how I work out and, like, in quarantine specifically because it's definitely different than, um, how I work out, like, at school. Um, so, I, uh, my, <laughs> so, First of all, my season, my swim season ended February 16th or something like that. Um, and so like, I'm still working out a little bit, but I was kind of like taking a little break and then quarantine happened. Um, so I'm trying to actually right now get my like endurance and strength up to being able to work out as long as I would um, in regular season, not like in winter training because that was like freaking four or five hours a day. And I don't need to work out four or five hours a day. That's ridiculous and should be confined to that two week period when all I'm doing is swimming. <laughs> um, so I pretty much do a couple different workouts and then sometimes we'll do a little bit of my own. So yesterday what I did was my mom's a personal trainer and she and a swim coach. So she did like a Zoom um, class for her swim team um and so I just joined her for that and then afterwards I did like a jump rope um random workout that I'll probably do today because it was a lot of fun um but what I've been doing for the most part um is I have been going to either Natasha Ocean or I don't know if I'm saying her last name right or Madfit um, and there was one other person that I want to try their workout out. 
Um, and I'll do one of them, one or two of them, like in a row. Um, and then I usually try to do like Alexis Ren's um, ab workout just because I really like it personally. She has like a lot of my favorite ab movements in it, so I enjoy it. Um, I've tried to do like other ones, but I just, you know, you like certain ab movements and you don't like other ones. And I like the ones that are in that video. So I do that often. So yeah, right now I'm just trying to decide which one I'm gonna do. There's also, I go on um, Equinox's Instagram and do their workouts sometimes because they've been posting um, Instagram TVs. So I try to get in like some kind of cardio um, just cause it's good for you. And then also like body weight, strength moves. Um, cause I want to stay strong and I want to get stronger obviously, but it's a little harder to do, um, this way. So the other person I was thinking about doing or trying that I haven't tried before is, uh, okay, it's Kaylee Varney. Um, and I watched one of her videos last night. And decided that I want to do that and looks like she just added another one so I'm gonna do both of those they're both 15 minute workouts um, so I'll do those one is a butt one and one is an ab one um, and then maybe I'll do like the butt one twice through the ab one and then a jump rope just because it's fun to me and then I'll do, okay, so butt twice, ab once, jump rope thing that I'll show you how I do. Um, it's also a way to jump rope, so it really, you know, gets those arms. Um, and then, yeah, that's what I'm going to do. Okay, let's just, let's go for it. You'll see what I'm going to do. Um, so I put on workout clothes, and I actually have really cute leggings from Lululemon on. Um, fun fact, my one pride and joy are my workout bottoms. Um, I just feel like I have a lot of cute ones, and they last long, and they are good quality, and, um, it's my pride and joy, I would say. <laughs> um, yeah, my mom gets me a lot of them. And then I bought these ones I bought myself. So, and they're like one of my favorite. I just think they're so cool. And I guess I'll do a better view later. But my mom just started um, training my grandma, actually. <laughs> and uh, my mom's using some of the equipment that I need. And by equipment, I mean a yoga mat, just because otherwise I'll get carpet burn on my like arms. And that's just so uncomfortable. And I'm not done for that so now I'm just waiting I have not done like anything I keep touching my hair I'm sorry that's probably really freaking annoying okay these are the leggings they're just so cute and then I'm wearing um a shirt that I got from being an athlete you know so I'm literally just gonna follow the workout on my computer I don't know if I'm gonna be doing the jump rope thing anymore because like I don't know if I want to, so <laughs> that's literally the only reason, I don't have any other reason, I just am not sure if I'm feeling it, so that's okay, you know, that's okay, do what you want to do, do what you gotta do, push yourself, but don't hate yourself, I guess, <laughs> um, so her workout calls for ankle weights and I'm pretty sure a band. I don't have an actual band so I'm just going to try this one. Um, it's not that hard. Like it's not that not super resistant. It's pretty light actually. But um, I watched a video last night and it looked like a lot of fun so I'm just going to do it now. I'll link them, what I'm doing down below, if you're interested. Okay, I have, um, I just done one round of it, so one video through, and my legs literally, 
heartburn so much. Um, I'm gonna drink some water. Maybe I'll do the abs in between and then come back to it. Yeah, I'm gonna do that because my legs hurt a lot. I look um, really great. <laughs> But I just did the ab one. I actually really liked it. I didn't look at it before, so I didn't know if I was gonna like it or not. Um, fixing my hair literally because what the heck? Everything looks a little better. So I've hit like about a half hour. Yesterday I worked out for an hour 15, so today I wanna try to get to an hour 30. Yeah, so I've got an hour more to go. Um, I'm gonna drink some water, do that one again. And then do the Alexis Run one. The jump roping. I hate to see it, but uh, love to see it too. So, I would love to say I <laughs> I just realized the last song I was playing on Spotify was Here Kitty Kitty by uh, Joe Exotic. Um, I just found this girl yesterday and like I just really love her vibe. So, I would definitely recommend watching her videos. Okay, I cannot see myself, but I'm doing one minute walk, three minutes run, and I'm just gonna go, I think for like two miles. I'm not a great runner. I'm a bad runner. I hope you guys can hear me because I'm using these. Okay, it's a couple days later. Um, I think I somehow just didn't hit record on the clip right after the last one you just saw to tell you how many, how, how much I ran. Um, I only went a mile and a half, <laughs> but it was plenty, and I'm pretty sure in that clip, um, I talked about how I felt really dead and <laughs> how I feel like I can, like, gauge a really good workout based off if I can feel like I could throw up. Um, not that that's, like, the goal, but, um, <laughs> as a swimmer, if you ever have uh, been out there swimming the 4am or the mile or the literally anything like you have definitely got that feeling where you are going to throw up and just die <laughs> from your race so um that's one way i feel like i know i've put in like the most amount of effort that i can as extreme as that sounds you obviously do not have to go that far to like get a good workout in um that's just personal um craziness i would say <laughs> um and yeah, that's pretty much it for this video. One other thing that I did just find, um, which maybe would be helpful for some of you guys, because I know like, for <laughs> moving your body and staying active as it is can be a hard thing to start or a hard thing to be like consistent with, or just, it's a hard thing in general. Um, so finding something that you like to do is really, really important. And right now it's even harder because the things that we like to do might be taken away. It's just like, I can't swim right now. If you're really into Pilates, you can't do that really right now unless you have like your own Pilates reformer in your house, which would be crazy. Um, you know, if you like like stationary biking, that's harder to do right now. Like there's a lot of weight lifting, hard to do right now. Um, so right now is like a time where you have to find something kind of new that you enjoy. So I wanted to give some other options that I know I've been enjoying beyond what I did in this video that I didn't really show you, but that I kind of talked through. Um, so I have been enjoying um, workouts on Equinox's Instagram. I especially like their ab workouts. They are killer, but um, they're a lot of fun. I've been really enjoying Natasha Ocean's hit workouts um, to get a really good sweat going. I like doing Mad Fit's like singular song workouts. Um, they're a lot of fun and they like the movements like go with the beat of the music and so if you're like into listening to music while you work out, which I think most people are, um, that's a definite good one. Um, who else? Oh, I liked Kaylee Varney. I talked about her in this video. Those are the workouts that I did video she's just like cool chill um yeah i would recommend her um who else i personally like alexis friends ab workout talked about that before um 
different like running apps if you're trying to get into running are a lot of fun nike run club they also have another app a, uh, nike i don't know what it's called i'll insert it here um nike something and that one's a lot of fun the good thing with, with the nike run club is they have like a coach who kind of takes you along how to run and how to like not get injured um, which is a lot of fun. And then I did just find one tonight that is like, it's called Zombie Run. I found it on TikTok and then I downloaded it on my phone and essentially you're given like missions and like zombies can like chase after you. And it just sounds like a lot of fun. So I'm gonna do that tomorrow um, and I'll um, film another video tomorrow and let you guys know how it goes. But I am really, really excited to try that one out um what else is there there's obviously yoga you can do yoga right now i personally have a definite love hate relationship with yoga mostly hate i just <laughs> i want to like yoga but it hurts me so much the stretch the holds all of it kill me but if you're into yoga um, yoga with Adrian is a definite go-to for me when I decide I need to get some yoga in and yeah that's kind of what I've been sticking to what I know and I hope it's helpful to you guys um, because it is really important to keep yourself moving during this time um, working out getting a sweat on produces endorphins um, that just keep your mood higher up and that's really really important for when it is maybe a little difficult to um to have that good positive mood so yeah anyway thank you for watching i hope you enjoyed the video stay healthy stay stay <laughs> stay healthy stay safe and i will see you in the next one bye